there, welcome back to the channel. I'm here again in London and today I'm going to take a walk around Soho, check out some of the shops, some of the streets, um, one of my favourite parts of London. So yeah, come and join me, see what we can see around this wonderful city. And don't forget, if you like the video, please subscribe, please like, please click the little bell for notifications. Yeah, and I will see you in London. So I'm currently in Leicester Square, not a place I used to come when I'm in London but I've just been to Japan Centre for a bite to eat, which was lovely. Um, so yeah, I'm going to head into Soho, check out the LGBTQ areas, a couple of record shops, all that good stuff. It's always mega busy here. Tourist Central, woohoo! Okay, I'll see you in a sec. So I'm currently in Chinatown, as you can see. Really popular area again. Big tourist spot. It's a lovely place to get something to eat. Some great restaurants. Some cool bakeries. Such a beautiful day again, as it has been for the last few days. Here at Chinatown Bakery, got some really nice stuff in here. Let's have a quick peek. Very cool, and you can just see them making the waffles there. You're playing the old one. I'll cook fresh. So I'll just walk a bit further down here. And as you can see, it's so busy. It's got a lovely atmosphere. Lovely lanterns up there, heading all the way down there. Oh, cute! Oh, yay! <laughs> Right, I'm going to head into my favourite part, Soho. So we're just crossing over Shaftesbury Avenue, heading into Wardour Street. And just over there on the right is the Compton's Pub. Nice to see the trans flag flying, the progress flag. Lovely. Such a beautiful area this, I love it. Famous Admiral Duncan. Beautiful. So cool. Lovely place. Dean Street to the left there. Loads of places to eat, drink, lots of nice food places. Soho Whiskey Club. Cool. Cafe de Nata here on the corner. This is one for Colin from the Chatter Guys. Check this out. Woo, I know you love these. Beautiful. I'm going to get one in a bit. I have a bit of a mooch first and I'm in there. Right, I'm just going to head up Thrift Street to see Bar Italia. Really cool old building. It's been there for ages. Very popular with mods. I think they have their old scooter club there actually. It's Bar Italia. Just there. And directly opposite we have Ronnie Scott's Jazz Club. It's at Old Compton Street. We've got the Bar Soho there. It's really cool. We've got GAY. We have the trends and progress flags flying outside as well. 
Lovely to see. Fantastic. We're just coming towards the end of Old Compton Street and I'm going ahead of the road to Denmark Street. I haven't been there for absolutely ages. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of music shops are still there. Um, it used to be full of old guitar shops, vintage instrument shops, and it's where the Sex Pistols used to live. So let's go and check it out. Like I say, I've not been there for ages, so I don't know how it's changed. I, I know they've kind of closed a lot of the shops down there, but let's go and have a look. Foils there, which used to be St. Martin's College, and I think that's where the Sex Pistols played the first ever gig where they got unplugged. Clem Matlock was a student there and um, yeah, I got them a gig and they got unplugged after about three songs. Now I think I'm right about this, but the Sex Pistols gig at St Martin's College, they were supporting a band called Bazooka Joe, which was uh, Adam Ant's original band. I might be wrong, <laughs> don't quote me on it, but I think I'm right. Got to be right at some time, and I? Okay, let's head over to Denmark Street, check out what's going on there just across the road here. So here we are on Denmark Street. As you can see, there's still some music shops open. Nowhere near as many as there used to be. Um, here's Hanks. Cool shop. A nice rick and back in the window there. A little bit of music as well, excellent. Got the lower third there, which was David Bowie's original band, David Jones the Lower Third. I guess that's where the name's from. So just heading back up Denmark Street, we've got Regent Sound Studios there, which was originally a recording studio. The Rolling Stones recorded there, David Bowie, lots of other people. I think Tom Jones recorded the original demo of It's Not Unusual there. <laughs> Very cool place. So yeah, the Rolling Stones recording Not Fade Away there. There's recent sound studios. Just there we have number six Denmark Street, which is where the Sex Pistols used to live and rehearse. In the back there, it's offices now, but there are loads of drawings and paintings on the wall, what the band did when they lived there. Loads of history. Oh, some drums in the window, yay. Okay, just gonna head back into the centre of Soho. See you in a sec. So we're back in Old Compton Street, just outside the Admiral Duncan, as you can see there. Um, it's gonna take a walk up near Carnaby Street, around there, check out some record shops, clothes shops, see what's going on. See you in a sec. So I'm just in down in the middle of Berwick Street, Berwick Street. And there's that right. And there's a lovely market on. Lots of street food. Really cool. Yeah. Oh, it smells amazing down here. This used to be like a big fruit and veg market. Lots of barrels and stuff, but now it's all street food. Oh, it smells amazing. Let's see what they've got. Quick bites. More than 20 times below. Coffee shop. Coffee shop there. Seems really cool. Street food. Very nice. Cool, cool. It's very popular as well, which is good. <laughs> got pad thai. It's very nice. Palestinian food, Vietnamese food. Really cool. Like I say, it smells absolutely amazing down here. Just heading down Broadwick Street now, excuse the noise. 
um, the Agent Provocateur shops down here and also Sounds of the Universe Records which actually used to be a pub and it's where the Rolling Stones first met and first started playing. So yeah, let's go and have a mooch. Okay, let's head back onto Berwick Street. Berwick Street, Berwick Street. I don't know how to pronounce it. This is where Oasis uh, photographed What's the Story Morning Glory album cover in the middle of the street on Berwick Street. Berwick Street, that one. <laughs> it was just in the middle of the street here. What's the Story Morning Glory, that one. Apart from it didn't sound anything like that. <laughs> so some great record shops for you. We've got Reckless and we've got Sister Ray directly opposite. So let's go and have a mooch, see if we can find any of my band stuff in there. You never know. Usually do, but we'll have a look. <laughs> see you in Reckless. So that was Reckless Records, no Amiga driving now unfortunately. So let's have a look at Sister Ray, just across the road. I just said, I was like... This used to be further down there, but it's been here now a few years. Okay, I'm just going to head up to Carnaby Street. Have a look around there now. I'll see you there. So we're now just outside of Liberty's department store, about to head onto Carnaby Street, which is just down there to the right. So yeah, let's cross the road and head down there. Check out the sky, it's such an amazing day. Let's cross the road here. Thank you. Liberties. Here we are on Carnaby Street. It's so busy. Wow. Blimey. It's very, very different to how it was in the 60s and 70s. I think at one time there was even traffic down the middle of here, but that was a long time ago, way before my time. I'm only like 20 or something. Yeah, right. <laughs> So, it's, uh, so yeah, there's lots of big brand kind of fashion shops down here. There used to be a lot of mod and punk clothing stores down here, but not really anymore. I think there's a couple left, but that's about it really. What did you do for There's still a cool streets I've walked down. It's the middle. It's a shiny kind of street sign up there. It's Ganton Street down the side. And just on the corner of Broadwick Street, there's a lovely mural on the wall there. We're going to have a look at that. 
Yeah. Someone filming here? Fuck all. Got Matt and Sharp. Replay. Got Levi's over there. So I'm now in Golden Square Gardens in Soho Square. Lovely place to come and sit and eat, chill out, enjoy the weather. So I'm currently right in the centre of Piccadilly Circus, near the Eros statue there. Um, it's really, really busy, as you can see. I think I've said that a lot today, but London is really busy today. So I'm back on Brewer Street, just heading up to Old Compton Street again, where I'm going to get myself a sweet treat. Natter away. So that was my little look around Soho. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe, please hit the like button, click the little bell for notifications, and I will see you very, very soon. Take care.